Here we have a lamp by Crompton. There's the blurb about it. 240 volt, 35 watt CE and the energy figures which you can see is not very efficient. Anyhow, let's look at the lamp. I don't think I've put this one up before. There's a lamp's a tubular but with the pegs on the side. As the carton says, two peg caps. I believe there are different types of these lamps that have got different shapes, pegs. So obviously this one is a, a circular peg and presumably the one they use over here. I think years ago these tubes were called architectural tubes. I believe on the continent they might be called Linestra. But um, as far as I'm concerned it's a tubular lamp with side contacts for connecting up and they fit into a holder. You, all you see is obviously just that part which would be a light. I can't light this because um, I'm not set up for these. So I will apologise. It's a worker. You can see looking down inside there you can see the way it's made. It's more or less made like a normal strip light. They're held in by position there and a position there which is placed against the glass to keep the centre stem if you like firm and not shaking about. Looking down the other end you can also see that it is perfectly okay. What I do notice is the actual stem itself has got this red uh, kind of paint on it and I understand this is a gettering material that is used to reduce any traces of air that might be inside the tube still. And I see it goes the whole length, there's, there's the other length. To me there's quite a, it is quite a lot so they're going to make sure that uh, <laughs> there's no oxygen or air left in the tube. It's a getter. Normally get those on valves. As I say, I don't know if I've got any here which I can show you what I mean. Is that one there, I wonder? No, I don't know. I haven't got one handy, so I can't show you. Now those tubes are actually, uh, they've got neon gas in, in them. So anyhow, not to worry, that is the lamp itself, architectural, and they used to be made, whether they still are, I don't know, in various shapes and various lengths. Some were curved, and so when they, as I say, they, they weren't common, but they did appear, and they were to be fitted into special holders and um, light fittings look quite effective but that was years ago so there's the lamp anyway, any questions please ask and um, I'll try and give you an answer once again if I don't know the answer I know someone that might because these I believe were more common on the continent so, um, as I say you might get a better answer from my friend anyhow thanks again for watching um, don't know what I'm going to put up next. I'm in quite a good mood, so anything could be put up next. Anyhow, thanks a lot. Thank you.